Right now, one of Ohio's biggest Halloween parties is underway. This year, doubling as an opportunity to support the Oregon District after the August shooting. 2 News reporter Aaliyah Williamson has more on this year's Haunt Fest. Adam, the fun starts right here. I'm at the main gate right off of 5th Street. We're right by the Omega Music Store. This is one of the few ways that you're going to be able to get in, and that's only if you have a ticket. That's how you'll be able to enjoy the bands, DJ, food, and more fun that the 2019 Haunt Fest has to offer. Event organizers tell me they expect anywhere between five and 15,000 people to show up for tonight's fun. The damp and chilly fall weather is setting the perfect gloomy mood for the 2019 Haunt Fest. And it's not stopping this Dayton tradition. We have this every year. We, we don't cancel it. We haven't canceled it for anything as far as I can know in the last 20 years at least. Event organizers say Hump Fest is more than just a party. It's also an opportunity to come together to support the community. Sean Kramer says that's the part she's looking forward to the most. Just being in the Oregon District, supporting the businesses and the restaurants and bars. It helps us fund every other thing that we do here. Like plowing the sidewalks in the winter and all sorts of whatever else we need done here in the neighborhood. Kramer says she's been to Haunt Fest many times and this year she noticed something a little different. We noticed the large police presence when we drove in and we were both very happy to see that. The Dayton City Commission approved $22,000 for more police officers to patrol the district. Haunt Fest organizers say they're taking other safety precautions ahead of the block party. Um, we have police overtime here. Um, we're checking everybody in. Um, there's no weapons allowed. There's no toys of weapons. Nothing that even looks like a weapon coming in. Uh Despite the increased security measures more than two months after the Oregon District tragedy, president of the Business Association believes things are getting better day by day, and Haunt Fest is just the latest example of that. The neighborhood feels strong. We're, we're stronger than ever. In addition to security, there are also undercover police officers that are patrolling and making sure that everyone has a fun and safe time. That is until 1 a.m. when the party stops. Here in the Oregon District, Aaliyah Williamson, 2 News, working for you.